Now, with the deadline just a few days away, there is a flurry of activity to get things in and out of the budget proposed by Governor Andrew Cuomo. And one of them deals with tax breaks for filming TV shows and movies here in New York State. News Channel 9's Jeff Kulikowski has more this evening. Jeff, uh, Senator Bob Antonacci has a bill dealing with this, I'm told. Uh, what does he want to do with the tax credit? Well, he's pretty clear about it, uh, Rod and Christy. He wants to go ahead and just eliminate what is known as the Empire State Film Production Tax Credit altogether. The program calls for credits of $420 million per year that can be allocated and used to encourage companies to film projects in New York State to help create and maintain film industry jobs. Now, in the last few years, Central New York has started to see more and more of these films and TV shows shot here, most of them eligible for tax breaks under this program. Now, of course, New York City sees a vast majority of these shoots and shows, which is one of Senator Antonacci's complaints, that it heavily favors downstate. And this isn't the first time Antonacci has raised concerns over spending on the film and TV industry in New York State. As Onondaga County Comptroller, he audited the film hub in DeWitt, which he says has not lived up to the $15 million state investment to bring productions and create jobs in the Syracuse area. We need to refocus on where we're spending our money, not only in economic development, but across the board. I also share a, a, a district, a school district, Auburn School District, with Senator Pam Helming, and I can tell you that the citizens of Cayuga County and the students that go to school in Auburn do not need to be in the throes of celebrity. They need sustainable jobs that can provide long-term uh, fiscal impact, long-term employment. Now, the governor's office through the state's film and television uh, website actually has gathered a bunch of numbers on this program. They say the investment's paying off, and that is, as of January 1st of 2011, about 15 appli 1,500 applications have been accepted to the film production tax credit program. That, they say, generates an estimated $24 billion in spending and nearly 1.5 million hires. Right now, Senator Antonacci's bill is in committee in the Senate. Rod.